Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's like bonus video. I recently shopped the Sephora fall sale and I wanted to haul everything for you guys. Um, so I went crazy for me. I like this is the most I've ever spent in one foul swoop at Sephora and I'm so excited with everything I got. Basically at, so at the beginning of this year, I was a beauty insider. In the April sale, I moved up to a VIB. And with not this purchase, but with this purchase and then an additional purchase, I am now a VIB Rouge member, which like, you have to spend a lot of money. And as soon as I got that email, I was like, what did I do? But, um, the second order is like Christmas gifts for me, for my sister, and partially some stuff for her. But with 20% off, I was like, why not? So, um, the sale is over, um, but it was, there was one weekend, the first weekend of November for just VIB Rouge members, but I wasn't there yet, so um, I didn't have access to that. And then it started on November 10th. I like had my cart ready to go, like did it as soon as I got up on the morning of the 10th and it arrived on Wednesday, which was the 15th. Um, so it was pretty fast, but because the sale's over, it's not like, I'll leave all the info below because it's over, but I am going to show you everything that I got. I'm so excited. Okay. Um, I did also replenish some stuff. So the first thing is the original beauty blender. Um, does anybody's go moldy? I think mine might have been. Um, so I knew I needed a new one and probably like a couple weeks ago. And Ethan was like, just get one now. And I was like, no, I'm going to wait for 20% off. So I got a new one, which I will use and hopefully take better care of. Um, maybe I'll do all the things I replenished first. Also, the Urban Decay All Nighter Long Lasting Setting Spray. There was a kit or like a thing that was two of them for $48 when one was $40. And I really should have done that. Um, and then by the time I realized and I went back, it was sold out, so, but I also don't know how fast I go through it, so I've gone through one and one of the travel size in over a year, so this should last me for a while. This is the first one with the new packaging, so I'm excited about that, and I have opened that and used that. Then, other thing that I replenished is the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper. Um, mine's still fine, should be for a while. I bought it in the April sale and it's still good. Um, so there is that. Um, but just to have a backup. Um, and then the other thing that I like kind of replenished is I got the birthday gift. Um, this year was uh, I picked the Tarte one so it had like the Amazonian clay blush and a mini size of this Tardius lip paint in a birthday suit so I got the full size of that and that is what I'm wearing right now. I'll do a swatch of it on my hand just so you can see but I love this color just like a nice nude. It does look a bit darker on camera. Of course I can't like turn my hand the right way. There we go. It's just a really nice color and it's like moist. Like it's hydrating on the lips too and it lasts a while. I feel like sometimes it looks a little bit darker on camera. Like it's not that much darker than my regular lip color but I'm very happy to have gotten that. And then the other thing that I kind of replenished is I got more pads for my Shiseido eyelash curler. I think I have one lying around somewhere, but I couldn't find it, so I figured I'd get more, and I didn't realize that it came with two, so that's awesome, and that will last me a while. Okay, now on to the new stuff. I got... So my kind of, like, reasoning for spending so much money 
is I'm getting married next year and I want my like skin to be the best it has ever been so I don't have to wear a ton of makeup like obviously I'm gonna wear makeup but I don't want to wear a ton um, so I got this Origins Ginseng Refreshing Eye Cream to brighten and depuff. Um, so it comes in a little jar like this. It was a lot smaller than I um, like thought it would be. According to the picture, it looked to be about the size of a hockey puck, <laughs> which is it is not. But I'm excited to start using this. I also like tried to not use anything because wanted to share like the packaging and stuff with you guys. So there's that. And then I got the Tarte uh, Rainforest of the Sea Water Foundation, which I am excited to try. This is in the shade Fair Neutral. But like, look at this, like number one, look at that. Number two, like look at that so pretty and it's like the little dropper like applicator so excited to try it and it's a very good match for my skin tone I did like google it like I found some website that you like put in what um, shade you are in one brand and it'll recommend another and then the other um, thing that I picked up was the Clinique Acne Solutions BB Cream. Uh, it has SPF 40 in it and like if I don't have to wear a foundation I'd probably rather wear a BB cream. This has like something in it to make it shake vigorously but that's this. Um, Makeup by Tiffany D like swears by this and the actual foundation in the Acne Solutions line so I'm excited to try that out and that is in the shade Light I believe Yes, Light. I think this one doesn't have a ton of shades but then the foundation does um, And then now I'm going to show you the I redeemed some points so I'm gonna show you what I redeemed for points my free samples and then I'm gonna show you like the thing that I'm most excited for so this I don't remember how many points this was but it's like a little tray and it's really cute I did want something to um, put my rings in for when I shower because I take them off and I'm terrified of them um, like falling down the drain so it says wake up wake up to makeup. This is a lot smaller than I thought it would be as well, but whatever. It was technically free, so I'm excited to have that and like to put makeup brushes in when they're hanging to like laying out to dry, stuff like that, but I thought that was a nice little gift. I'm like running out of room on the table because the box is so big. This is also the biggest box I've ever gotten ordering online from Sephora. Um, so this is the VIB like welcome, welcome kit. I didn't even know this was a thing so I didn't get it when I became a VIB member and I hope I can still use this but it comes with like a 10% off coupon and a complimentary makeover. But like I feel all fancy. And then the oh also I bought this um, the Sephora brand charcoal nose strip. It was like four dollars and I was like oh, I'll give that a try if it's like excruciatingly painful then I'll probably never buy it again but thought it would be nice to try. That's not the thing that I'm most excited for. Okay I got a sample of the Clinique Moisture Surge um, like moisturizer gel cream. Just got a sample of that. Got a sample of the Boing Benefit Concealer um, in shade number two and uh, the Too Faced Born This Way um, foundation so it comes with three shades uh, but like look at the packaging it's just so pretty so it comes with vanilla light beige and sand I think this might even be too dark for me so we'll see but again just to try it out just excited to try stuff out okay are you ready you ready for the thing that I'm like most excited for 
I splurged and I got myself a Clarisonic. I'm so happy and so excited to use it. Um, so this is the Mia 2, uh, two speed facial gentle sonic cleansing. Um, and then it was the kit that came with all the Basha. So it came with the black hydrating gel, the thermal black cleanser and the luminizing black mask. The black mask I have wanted to try so it kind of made sense to get this and it was so $262 estimated value and it was $219 with 20% off so it was even more than less than that I should say. Um, but I'm so excited to use this. Again I want my skin to be as good as possible. Okay I did already open this to see what was in it like to see what everything looked like Ugh. and now I'm struggling okay so this is what the box like looks like um, and there is everything in it Whoop. so small sizes but still it's like an expensive brand so I'm excited to try these and then like look at it it's so cute I'm so excited and this brush head is very soft so this is like the there's a bunch of different brush heads um this is the radiance one um and I was a little nervous about like I'm definitely gonna add it into my routine slowly just to not overwhelm my skin um but I was worried that that brush might be too harsh so I also picked up the sensitive brush head um, which it also gives me an extra brush head for when I need to change it. But honestly, that one feels, the, the one that comes with it feels softer. But I'm so excited, guys. Um, if you, okay, I'm going to pull this back in the box. So that is everything that I picked up during the sale. Um, if you guys shop the sale definitely let me know what you guys got and let me know like if there's any products you're loving or any recommendations or anything because I will take them for me like perusing the Sephora app is like going on Pinterest like I can sit on there for hours like there's so many different products and brands and like I've watched a bunch of videos of hauls like this and like stuff I've never even heard of like if everybody's haul is so much different because there's just so many products but I am so happy to have this stuff finally like I was just waiting for it come to come like kept tracking it my package um but now it's here and I get to start to use everything and I am so excited um one thing that I did want to mention is I also used Ebates when I shopped so I got I think it was 2.5 percent cash back for my purchase um, so if you want to know more about Ebates, I'll put a link down below, um, but it's like I saved 20% and then got more money back. So definitely would recommend using that and it's like available for stores like Amazon and Chapters and Indigo and like so many stores and all you have to do is basically you go to the Ebates page or the Ebates app before you go to the website that you're shopping from. So the morning that the sale was live, I logged on to Ebates, clicked Sephora, it took me to the Sephora website, and then I shopped and I already had everything in my cart, so it took me like two minutes. But if you guys want to get more cash back, definitely check that out. Like I said, I'll link it below. And that is it. Whew, this video isn't as long as I thought it would be because I'm so excited that I'm like blah blah blah. But I hope you guys enjoyed a look at everything that I picked up during the Sephora, Sephora fall sale and thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. I will see you guys in my next video and thank you again so much for watching. Bye!